with a gun. There's a guy right behind me too with a... Oh my god, really dude? <sighs> yeah, this is what I've been dealing with for the past few weeks. The title of this highlight kind of explains it all, but the experience I went through is kind of mind-boggling. Honestly, it isn't something I can put into words. So, as per usual, you'll just have to see it for yourselves. But, before this starts, I do want to apologize for the lower quality. I had to rip some footage from the stream due to some technical problems, but hey, at least you get to see my big shiny forehead, right? Let's change up the track a bit. That's a huge commitment. We have to switch OBS. Oh, well, that was easy. This will be my first official fight of the wipe. And as you guys saw, it did not go too well. But as every and all things go in rust, you respawn and try again. Frags we needed right there. This is low for rest. Oh shit. <sighs> Fuck my life. Please, man. I'm being shot at by Bolty. Sometimes it takes a few tries. It's whenever I try to do an action, it freezes. I went to press knock on the door and it freezes. It fucking freezes, man. Two Sheilas, dude. Oh, have I been blessed with the Sheilas? The Sheila gods? Um, okay. I set out towards the coast to look for a boat. The area I was in wasn't too great for a solo player. Let's, should we move into this thing? This might not be bad. We have a level 2 to work off of. I mean, it's on the coast, but it's really close to other things. Got a TC in it already? This wouldn't be a bad idea. Let's do this. Fuck it. Oh. Hi. Yeah. Hi. Ow. Perfecto. Oh, 
Fuck my life! Okay. We're almost there, lads. Now that I had a secure base down, I set out on an adventure to look for some more loot. Fuck it. If we die, we die. I'm gonna go out like men. Fuck it. I fucked up, boys. It was worth a shot. There he goes. This is kind of where things started to take a turn for the worse. I was using it on- Oh shit, there's a guy up there. He has a gun. He's gonna come over here, isn't he? Fucking god damn it! Oh! That's a different naked right there, right? Yeah. Oh. Oh fuck. Let's get behind this so we have cover. There we go. Nice. Perfect. Did I hear somebody up above me? Holy shit, there's so many boars. Oh, I hit that boar. Would you die? That bear literally won't die. There he goes. Go away. And we made it. Solid run. Fuck yeah. I need Hard to explain. Here's the thing about being solo. Most fights you take, you will most likely be outnumbered. Holy fuck. Oh my fucking god. I thought that was just a naked hitting a node. And in most cases, when you start a bit late into the wipe, as I did, being outgunned is a very common thing. Here is a few good examples. But I can only use a gun. Oh, fuck. Fuck. Oh, fuck me. No, 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 no. Please, no. Oh, I'm fucked here. I'm fucked here. There's no way. Please, no freezes right now. Come on! Swim me, fat ass! Go! Please! No! <laughs> For fuck's sake! Oh, my God! a double barrel that would have been game over boys <laughs> having a gun can really make a big difference for a solo so i grabbed the scuba gear set and went to explore the waters for treasures Oh, 
as fuck. Look at that combat knife. Nice. Four seconds left in it. Oh, nice. What about? Cool. Ooh, these knockers are kind of handy. Nice, look at that, another diamond tank in that one. So I could... Oh. Oh. oh! Flippers. Bunch of water bottles around here that I can go down for. Ten out of ten. I spent a good half hour looting nothing but barrels and crates with no luck or signs of any guns. Even this guy was having no luck. There's a cleaver. What's up, bitch? What's up? <laughs> My situation was rough. Each and every direction I went from the base had either bigger groups or just people with guns. Go! Please! No! For fuck's sake! I needed to change up my plan. Fuck. Oh, uh oh, my game's frozen. This is no bueno, boys. I think my game might have crashed. Oh, yay, yay. This was a pretty consistent problem throughout my time playing. You guys have seen a few occasions, but this is just only the beginning. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm restart my PC real quick, guys. One second. Big rip, boys. I did die. That's unfortunate. Let's try this again. I need your scrap! Give me your fucking scrap! Oh, there's a kick up there. My game's frozen. I'm gonna fucking die, aren't I? Please, game! This has to be a joke! Oh. <gasps> what? What the fuck? I hit the fucking sign! Dude, come on, please! Not like this! Are you fucking kidding me, bro? How the fuck is this guy not... I'm gonna go insane. <laughs> oh my god. Are you fucking serious right now? This kid says I'm toggling after my game crash twice in this fight. Are you serious right now? Blow. Earth the kid. Earth the kid. Bro, you Dude, my game has crashed twice in that fight. How have you not killed me? Explain. Bro, can you Bro, okay, can I guess you don't explain. Me, Bro, can you 
I don't get it. I really am lost for words right now. What is going on right now, dude? I am so confused. I want to go home. I really just want to go home. Is that too much? Oh my God. Fuck you. Sorry. What is my life? Is this really what I'm doing for a living? How am I still alive? All this trouble and still no gun. The search continues. Maybe I do polish my forehead. Is there such a wrong thing? It's so bad. Chris, I really appreciate that. You're too kind. I know, it doesn't look like much, but this close to Broken Python would be the start of something amazing. Please. Please, no. Please no, please no, please no, please no. <laughs> what the fuck? If I fucking die, I'm done. Oh my fucking god, I am still alive. I don't even know what to fucking say. Okay. Let's try to get through this, guys. I gotta make it home. I think the Rust Gods are returning the favor right now, and they see my struggles, you know? We're gonna try to get home, we're gonna lock up the base, and then I'll probably uh, call it there, boys. I made a quick stop by a nearby shop to buy an extra weapon. If I die to a roof camper after all of this bullshit, I'm flipping my I'm flipping my desk. Um To the trees! To the fucking trees! I actually need the stone node to pit in the base. I actually need the stone node. Um, we're risking it. We need the stone node. We actually really need this. Um, Wolfie, no! After a long, treacherous journey of many crashes and mishaps, I finally made it home. Oh! Oh my god, I fucking made it home. I fucking made it. Research the fucking sun. Dude, I literally just went through hell for this fucking gun. Okay? I'm sorry. I'm done. I'm over it. I'm over it. We went through hell for this shit. We went across the fucking map for two guns. Crashed three times in the middle of a fight, crashed another time when we had a full inventory stuff in the middle of the open, and we still made it home. We still made it home. Somehow. I don't know. I don't get it, but I'm done. This game can suck my I want to take a second to thank you guys for your patience these last few months. I know my uploading schedule hasn't been the greatest, but it's all for a reason. I could just say that I've been extremely busy because that's the easy route and the easier thing to say. 
but in reality that isn't necessarily the case. You see, content creation isn't really an easy job, and I knew that when I first originally decided to start this. Spending days literally locked inside recording and editing takes a hefty toll mentally. It got to the point of lack of social life and extreme depression. It honestly caused me to lose a lot of motivation to even stream, record, edit, you know, anything along those lines, so I had to take a short little break to spend some time with family and travel a bit. I went literally across the country to Tennessee to support my friend at his wedding along with seeing some of the sights. Some I enjoyed more than others, but nonetheless it was a great time. I got back not too long ago and I'm starting to slowly regain my motivation to keep going. I'm not trying to use any of this as an excuse in any manner, but you guys do deserve to know what's going on. Again, sincerely thank you for all your support and patience, and until next time, stay hydrated.